At five, Atlanta's mayor is preparing for migrants from the southern border to come to Atlanta. Mayor Andre Dickens asked for, and the city council has approved, nearly $7 million for shelter in area hotels, food, and other necessities. Fox 5's Morse Diggs joins us live in northeast Atlanta with all the details. Morse. The nation's mayors, they meet twice a year and they talk in between. Andre Nick Dickens knows all about the pressures on New York City from this migration, and he wants to make sure nothing like that happens here. Almost nightly when the numbers run high, the influx of migrants shown on your TV screens. It was a Texas governor frustrated with the Democratic administration in Washington who was first to try to change the equation and send thousands to northern cities. In New York, one of the landing spots, the bills and the population are piling up. I don't see an ending to this. I don't see an ending to this. This issue will destroy New York City. I reject that notion. To use language that this will destroy the fabric of America, America was built uh, upon immigrant labor. Atlanta Councilwoman Keisha Waits and her colleagues supported Mayor Andre Dickens' initiative to fund at nearly $7 million a program to shelter migrants who make it to Atlanta. I spent several years serving with the Federal Emergency Management Agency. I stand behind this mayor uh, in terms of the decision to put this funding forward. At the end of the day, uh, these are families. These are human beings. The Atlanta cash secured with a federal grant will go to a half dozen organizations who will feed the individuals, put them in hotels, and meet other needs. The president decided to elevate some of the migrants who crossed over and give them a limited status. Work permits, you allow people to then, you know, they're seeking gainful employment, but you're not going to be deported. You're, you're sort of part of this economy in the United States and in the state of Georgia at this point, but it doesn't bestow on you citizen yourship rights, right? You, you can't vote. So if you have family members who have arrived in Georgia or are headed here, check out our website this evening. We will put the full list of those service organizations who are getting the money and can get them some help from Northeast Atlanta. I'm Morse Diggs, Fox 5 News. Morse, thanks.